um, the disc itself breaking down with the end plate broken down, that disc material enters into the vertebral body, which also is, you know, we refer to as vertebrogenic pain. So that's another thing that we treat. And, and there are ways that we can um, do fusions also, but posteriorly, where we don't necessarily have to do a major dissection. So how do you choose, man? There's so many cool <laughs> things. Uh, I don't know. Last time I saw an MRI, I saw all those things you just described <laughs> in one person. So, and so <laughs> that's that's, the, that's you do all of them. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, seriously, this is very important, right? So, like yeah. we're trying and to this, figure this out. This is what comes down to foundations, right? You have to have a strong foundation and strong diagnostic skills, right? Imaging is going to show so many things. It doesn't mean you necessarily need to treat it, right? And so you have to, you know, talk to your patient. First and most important thing, get your hands on them um, and then combine that with your imaging findings. And like you said, there's a myriad of things that we can do now. And there's never the unicorn patient that just has one thing. Or if there is, it's not the majority.